Well, as I vote to you that I will always be bringing you ex Big Brother housemates, whether in Big Brother Titans, whether in Big Brother Muzanzi, whether in Big Brother Niger, I will always do that to really go ahead and reciprocate love back to you, the subscribers of Afrogis Television. And today we are into the mix of you won't believe who JP is missing in the Big Brother house. And is it Marvin? Is it a boo boo? Name it. Who you want to really go ahead and really attach to JP? Welcome to Afro Geese Television. How are you guys and where you watching us from? I go by the names of Rock and David. Smash the like button, comment, and share. If at all you're watching us for the very first time, endeavor to subscribe. After subscribing to this channel, hit the notification bell. That will enable you to get notified every time I upload a video onto this channel. Now, as we jet towards the birthday of JP, she has revealed the housemaid she misses most. And allow me to throw into this video as JP pronounces the housemate she misses most. And the housemate is Mel. Hearing that, I've heard that every time since 2020. I have tags from my friends, friends shows like, girl, you look like this person, you look like this person. Love it. You miss me and my brown jacket. My dear, I miss my brown jacket. I don't even know why I left that jacket for a boo boo. But as soon as it gets out, I'm going to go collect my thing. Not my thing because it's his thing, but it became mine. After I wore it for one week straight, people told me that JP the jacket is. Because I would wash it and take it back. It's like, nice, nah, yours. But when I was leaving, maybe because I didn't think I was leaving, Sha, I just hung the jacket. I'm like, nah, I'm not leaving now. So I'm still going to wear my jacket when I'm done. When the show is over, <laughs> only for me to find myself. <laughs> So yeah, I'm like, nah, there's no reason to, you know, have to pick it up, leave it to my baby. I miss my jacket. I actually do miss that jacket. It's so strong. It's really unbelievable, but I miss that jacket. It really did become a part of me. I don't like the cold at all, but I always like to wear, you know, skimpy things like bralettes and shorts. So the jacket will just always come at me up while I wear my, my bralettes and shorts. I miss my brown jacket, so. Another V and Tolani look alike. I know, girl. I know. It's a honor. Cause they're pretty, they badass. <laughs> I love you too. From Ghana, love you right back from Nigeria. Wow, I'm really tired. You guys, where's my brown jacket? My brown jacket is in Big Brother's house. I'm waiting for the show to be over so that I can see my thing again. <laughs> my jacket is in Biggie's house, so it's in Big. I should have Biggie deliver, like ship it to me safe. In fact, Biggie, if you can hear this, I want my my brown jacket. <laughs> You're so pretty, thank you. Cause she's always saying nice things about you. So I've seen, she's such a sweetheart. She's such a beautiful woman. You know, it takes one to know another. Blue and I must be friends. Now this is unusual. Okay, I guess we'll see how it goes. I guess we'll see how it goes. Blue and I were not overly close in the house. We're just guys, hi, hi, B, hi, hi, B. But yeah, we'll see how it goes. She's a hot B, like her. So we'll see how it goes. When am I coming to the UK? Hmm. Hopefully soon. Because I have a lot of friends there. I have a lot of my nursing close friends. Even my friends are not nurses that there. So hopefully soon. I've been promising them forever. So I feel like my first vacation outside the country, anywhere that isn't South Africa or Dubai, would be the United Kingdom. Because I really do miss my friends who are there. I haven't seen them in like years. So yeah when will i come to ghana hmm i really should put this on the list on the bucket list i really haven't ever thought of it but i feel like i'm not going to want to come there alone so i have to figure out a time when i think some of my friends will be traveling there and then i will consider traveling with my friends i feel like that's the only way i'm going to come there because so somewhere i'm like I, I i feel familiar with so i have to make sure that my friends are coming and then i can travel with my friends Mm, I'm tired, you guys. I thought I like to talk, but mm -mm. when you hear my voice, I know, right? I love my voice too. <laughs> Considering that it's so different and husky and bold and strong. But yeah, I love to hear my voice too. I actually really do love my voice. And I feel like, some way, somehow, I have grown to love my voice even more now that I have, I have been to the show. For some reason, I have grown to love my voice more. I do. I absolutely. I am crazy 
about my voice i tell you this for free i'm in love with my voice why was i always complaining about the aircon in the house because the aircon was cold now i should not talk when i'm catching cold i was cold but if you know me you know that i don't like the cold i've never liked the cold i don't do well with cold at all so yeah that's why i was always wearing the jacket i don't do well with cold at all jp my favorite nigerian girl in the house wow sweetie you're looking gorgeous i miss you first of all your favorite love you boo and thank you thank you we miss you on our screens i miss you guys too i miss being on your screens but i'm on screen now shasso <laughs> um come back to south africa please i would for for a uh, fact for sure for certain i just don't know when yet but i have to eventually at some point you guys i think i see a cockroach let me kill it first i'm coming okay i was about to kill it and i just randomly remember that they said i should stop killing things and i realized that i'm alive with my south african fans so you guys i didn't kill it but it's upside down here but i didn't kill it sure because see i took all my lessons from the house seriously you see it's alive but it's upside down i'm not going to turn it upside down i'm just going to leave it here so you can turn it upside down by itself but i didn't kill it so there's that <laughs> You're one of my favorite housemates in the house. Thank you. Hi, favorite housemate. Hi, sweetheart. Hi. <laughs> should you request? Yeah, I think you can send a request. I should be able to take one or two, one before I go off. Love you from South Africa. Love you right back from here. Love you right back from Nigeria. girl you were glowing thank you girl thank you <laughs> thank you but maybe it's the light <laughs> thank you thank you so much love you right back thank you i'm looking gorgeous thank you sweetie love you right back how did i feel about the partnership in big brother's house <laughs> I don't know. I actually do not know that. Um, see, it's neither here nor there. It's just, it's just a bundle of feelings. Um, I don't know. Um, listen, I feel like I can answer the question, but I also feel like I can answer it. So. He had its pros and its cons, that's all I can say. In some way, it was a good thing, but in some way, it just wasn't particularly the best thing. That's how I feel about it. Yeah, that's how I feel about it. You did amazing on the show. Thank you. Thank you. I missed your voice, JP, from Liberia. Well, at least you get to hear it now. <laughs> I do miss screaming on the show, so I hear I screamed a lot. I don't doubt that. I'm quite a screamer. Such a loud voice. And then all I do is still shout. I can't even whisper. See, this is how I whisper. I can't. You end up being able to hear my whisper. Um. Um. I feel like. I feel like I've missed a lot. I feel like I've missed a lot. I saw one. Have I seen Jenny O? Yeah. I saw Jenny O today. No, I didn't see Olivia today, but I saw Jenny O. Okay. Um, I saw Jenny O today. Okay. I don't think Nelisa is online, so I cannot have her join the line. Hi, Dot Farm, my guy. How, hi, my G. How you doing? These messages are endless, you guys. It's so hard to keep up. I'm struggling. <laughs> I'm struggling. You wish I didn't leave early. You were waiting to see my drama in the house with Jenny O. I don't think that Jenny O and I would have had drama. Believe it or not. Like, I know that we're like both strong personalities. And we wouldn't have always agreed. But I don't think that we probably would have had drama. 
I don't think so. She was so. <laughs> so I'm not supposed to be like, I didn't want us to have any confrontation. So we just might not have had trauma. We might have disappointed you, even if we went there until the very last day. We just might not have had drama. Hi, Wambi, NJ from Zambia. Hi, darling. You guys, I think I have to go soon. My crush on the show. If I tell you, you're going to be so shocked. Take a wild guess. Take a wild guess. <laughs> but I'm not going to say anything. But take a wild guess. Take a wild guess. Should I give you guys a hint? Eh? Should I give you a hint? You're always pretty with your all back. Thank you. I love all back. I love like natural looks. I don't have stress for makeup or wigs or, you know, I just like to be. I don't like stress. Thank you. JP, why? Yeah, I've seen JP, why are you so loud? JP, you're so loud. It's annoying. I'm sorry now, but I'm not the one that puts the voice box in my truth it's not me it's god and then i'm not the one that made myself to be energy energy <laughs> i've just always been like that you know i've always had a strong personality a strong energy a strong voice plus i grew up among brothers like i didn't have any sister i grew up among like a bunch of brothers so i maybe i felt the need to be loud so they could hear me because it was always the guys talking i don't know what it was but yeah pretty much or maybe because I went to boarding house and I was bullied a bit. I mean, I just feel the need to come off strong so that I wouldn't be terrified. I don't know what it was, but it just happened. Do I miss, miss a boo boo? I really actually do miss a boo boo. Like, I didn't realize how much I missed that boy until I came out of the house because boo boo used to stress me in the house. I feel like you guys didn't see it, but he used to stress me a lot. Like, <laughs> we used to have very tiny squabbles. And I was saying, boo boo, you're getting on my nerves. You see, I like to get on your nerves. So yeah, I really do miss him. I actually miss those our annoying conversations. I really miss him. I really do miss him. You miss me in the diary room, Sleeping Beauty. I know, right? Big brother would he said, Oh, do you prefer Sleeping Beauty? I miss meeting the diary room. I think I love to talk to Big Brother. Even though everybody says I didn't smile in the diary room. I don't know. Maybe I didn't see what to smile about. But yeah, I miss being in the diary room. So what should you be expecting from me? Um First, I'm going to relaunch my business very soon. I sell fragrances. I'm going to do everything fragrance. So you should look out for that. I'm going to do everything fragrance. <laughs> so I'm going to do everything fragrance. I'm going to continue to sell other like branded fragrances, but I'm going to do my own thing, have my own fragrance line. Um, we're talking diffusers, scented candles, actual fragrances oils everything fragrances you're going to see like i'm super obsessed about fragrances so i'm going to go into that like full time like very strongly plenty energy and then hopefully with time i can finally come around to doing something that involves talking and making good use of this voice that some love and some hate but i don't think i could survive without doing something that involves talking so maybe some kind of talk show maybe youtube maybe a podcast I'm unsure about that, but I think I'm going to focus on my business mostly. Yeah. And then, you know, eventually some acting. Because I that I was a very good actor on the show. I've always known that I was a good actor, but I'm glad that I showed you guys. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah, most of that is what she look forward to. But immediately, immediately, like, in a couple weeks, like, we're talking in some days, in some weeks, immediately after my birthday, is my business. It's fragrances. I'm just going to flood you guys with everything fragrance so look out handle is jp's place by the way that's like my business page so you should look out for that i always look beautiful when i'm looking natural thank you sweetie i love it how is my friendship with marvin we're great we're good we're great friends he's my g he's also very annoying that boy stresses me i saw his message just now on my whatsapp but i didn't want to leave you guys but yes we're good we're, we're chill we're chill he stresses me annoys me I shout on his head sometimes. He's always laughing. Everything's always funny. But, but, <laughs> we're good. I watched you blame Luke about your eviction, but that's not the case because she never had fans as well. First of all, I have fans. <laughs> Leave me alone this night, though. 
very first of all, I have a community. I have people behind me. I have an army and they're jihad. Second of all, I never, ever, ever blamed Luki for my eviction. What, what do people watch? Where do people see these things? I need you to send me the link to where I blamed Luki. Where do people? Where do people? Have you not on the same social media? What are you people watching? That never happened, my darling. It did not happen. Nobody can be blamed for anything that happened on the show. I didn't say that. Except you're talking about one time when I said I'm more celebrity than Luki. Luki was right beside me when I said that. He's my friend. We're just joking around. Please, y'all yeah, should not be creating these narratives. Eh? Don't be. My partner and I are cool. What endorsement should, should we be expecting? This person even called me Pelumi. Called me my, 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 <laughs> by my name that my mother gave me. I guess we'll see along the line. But let's be patient. You can't know what endorsements to expect. You see them when they happen. Right? We good? Okay, okay. Have I seen Marvin? Yeah, yeah, I have. I have. I feel like there are only a couple of people who I haven't seen. But yeah. What ship do I think we sail outside? I mean, I don't know. I genuinely have zero idea. I miss your voice, JP. I miss I miss it too on the show. Hello, Sir Leaf. The matter, Sir Leaf. Hello, hi. What are, <laughs> what are we doing on Sunday? My sister, maybe it's a prayer session. You know. But I don't know. I guess we'll find out on Sunday and after Sunday. As of right now, I don't know. We have elections in Nigeria on Saturday. So I don't know what the weekend is going to be like, you guys. I have like zero idea. So um, I don't know what I'm doing on Sunday yet. Until then. <laughs> Hello, JP from Miko. <laughs> I reserve my comments. You that person that said Hello, JP from Miko. I reserve my comments. Hi, shout out to you, Miko, my dear. Hi. Somebody just call me microphone. You guys. Stop it. Stop. Say my nails. Thank you, sweetie. This is the Bellumi outside. Um, yes, this is. Mm -hmm. You just says we like your energy. Thank you, sweetie. Love it too. Love it too. People are like posting random names. I'm just saying Tabang, Kanaga Junior, Ebubu, Theo. I'm not sure what you're trying to say. Like, I'm just saying random names. You're not saying anything. You're just typing their names. Kanaga Junior, Theo. I'm not sure what you're trying to say. Please stop explaining to people about your voice. We love you like that. Thank you, my darling. Thank you. Just when you say stop explaining, somebody's already asking me why is your voice deep, eh? Eh? It's so hard. I love you, but you were so moody sometimes in the house. You were stressing me so much. My darling, it was not easy. I didn't have my mommy. I didn't have my men. I didn't have my friends. It was hard, you know, to not have family to talk to. I'm sorry I was moody sometimes. But it's, it's just real life. That, that's how you know that it's real life. Nobody's always happy all the time. Sometimes you're just sad. And you can't help it. If you have brothers, you will understand why you should be loud as a lady. I have four brothers and it made me loud and confident. Yes, my darling. If you have brothers, I feel like you're going to understand. Because I, I was like around six older brothers a lot of the time. They are very rowdy. They were in high school. Like you needed, you, you would see the need to be as loud as them to be to be amongst them that's just i think that's just what i think that all that i am was majorly influenced by growing up among six men i think that's just what it is where was where were we guys what were we doing with sandra jenia yeah, we were at an event for multi-choice there was a premiere of a movie that's where we all hung out today um you're the life of the party baby you're a sweet girl you hardly get angry and you're down to earth thank you you do know me very well first life of all right, you've heard JP very well. The housemaid that she's missing is a boo-boo. Is a boo-boo, not, not Marvin. I know most of you, your minds had rained to Marvin, but it's not Marvin this time around. It's a boo-boo, and obviously, feel free to go into the comment section and tell what you think about JP on all what she has really said. She has talked... She has talked a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, because it was like a Q and a her fans throwing in questions, and she has gone ahead to really give us the best of her brain that can afford sorry she has gone ahead to give us the best that her 
brain can afford to really reply to you. So, Rock and David remains my name. Guys, I sign out for now. Sweet, as I told you, we are doing three videos on a daily. One video left and it's coming three hours from now. Keep it. Afrogis Television. May the Almighty bless you abundantly. Me sign out for now.